we're going to see, uh, working as a bounce from the clubs, I actually never got hit with a bottle. However, I know at least a good seven, eight bouncers that got hit with beer bottles across the head. They're either thrown to them or they, they get him hit behind the head. What's the defense with a beer bottle behind the head? There is no defense because most of the times you don't see, especially in a club, lights are flashing, music is blasting, uh, adrenaline is kicking in, you probably won't even feel the ball, bottle. Normally they, they only see the blood, it's like, fuck, only after the fight, they're like, shit, I got a bottle over the head, or when they see the broken glasses. Okay, so we're gonna do a small scenario here where um, one of you guys is gonna smash a ball over his head, a bottle of water, okay? Now, a weapon is just an extension of your arm, right? So, come over here. So the principle is the same, whether I have a bat, whether I have a stick, if the beer bottle is coming over my head, it's always here I'm doing it. So go, go inside. It's always here I'm doing this. It's the same block, right? I don't need 15 blocks. So it's the same thing. I want to step in. Now, obviously, if the guy's, if he's here, he grabs me and he smacks me over the head, nothing you can do. All you want to do is turn around and hit him, okay? So what I want to see, you guys, you're in the club. You know, you don't like his fucking face. Uh, you don't like Filipinos. You're Filipino, right? You don't like Filipinos. Tell me he's a fucking Filipino bitch. And he fucking kick, kick his ass, you know what I mean? He's a fucking tough guy, he spilled your drink, whatever it is, pick a fight with him whenever you want to smack a ball over his head. You can, you know, I've literally seen balls being smashed like this, right? Where the person just grabbed it and literally smashed the ball in the guy's face like this. It wasn't really like this, right? The guy was a strong fucker. He broke fucking in his hand and everything, the guy's face was all shattered. However you want, walk up and yell, yo, motherfucker, you got a problem? If I just clap, good. Alright? That's it. So let me see that, guys. Let's go, scenario. Hey man, come on. Hey, what's up, man? How's it going? Hey, you're, outside, you're outside the club. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I don't want you to run around all over the place. I want you to stay close quarter. I want you to stay in here, okay? Yeah. This is the... yeah. Okay. Let's go, guys, go. Hey, dog, what's going on? How's it going, man? Let's go around the club. Alright, don't tell me. You better leave the motherfucker. Go, come on, get him. Punch him in the face, Greg. Bill, come on, help me, man. Greg, come on, punch him in the face, Greg. Greg, punch him in the face. Punch him in the face. Throw the bottle at him. Throw the bottle at him. Fuck, that's it. Good. Put him down. Put him down. Great. Good. Good. Oh, shit. Good work. So you guys can see there's not, you know, uh, throw the bottle at him. I did it because in most fucking clubs I've seen, in most yeah, fights I've seen, well, will just launch the, really launch nice. the fucking bottle. So, yeah. again, it's Sorry. just a fight. Again, the, the, the space is not realistic because if you're fighting in a club, I fought fucking so many times. You trip on bottles, you fall, you slip, there's music, there's sound, there's adrenaline, there's a million stuff. It's so hard because there's so much stuff happening at the same time, okay?